Yeah? Learning to live with growing older. Very interesting experience. You look great, though, by the way. Can I just say that? Oh, thank you. Yeah. No, no stuff done. No? If we talk about the silver screen icons, one name that undoubtedly comes to mind is Shirley MacLaine. At the age of 89, with a remarkable career spanning over 60 years and an Oscar under her belt, she continues to captivate audiences with her exceptional talent and magnetic on-screen roles. Join us as Shirley MacLaine reveals her simple yet effective Stay Young secrets that have contributed to her longevity and youthfulness. I'm very content, happy with contentment, satisfied, don't worry, and I think I'm living more in the present. Shirley MacLaine was born on April 24, 1934, in Richmond, Virginia. She made her debut in the movie scene with a memorable appearance in Alfred Hitchcock's The Trouble with Harry in 1955. As her career grew, MacLaine showcased her talents in a string of films that captured audiences' hearts. With roles in classics like Around the World in 80 Days, 1956, Some Came Running, 1958, and The Apartment, 1960, she earned a reputation as a versatile and captivating actress. However, it was her portrayal of Aurora Greenway in the beloved comedy-drama Terms of Endearment, 1983, that took MacLaine to new heights. This performance earned her the industry's highest honor, an Academy Award for Best Actress. Yet, her contributions to cinema go far beyond this iconic role. When you ask me, you know, who I am, or I am basically the work ethic of a dancer, because I started when I was two and a half or three, and that begins to form an attitude in your life that never changes. With her talent, grace, and enduring presence in the entertainment industry, Shirley MacLaine has cemented her status as a true Hollywood legend. She also won numerous awards, including an Academy Award, six Golden Globe Awards, two BAFTA Awards, and an Emmy Award. So how has Shirley MacLaine maintained her good health and age-defying wellness even at the age of 89? In this video, we'll dive into Shirley MacLaine's top three tips for feeling young. We'll also uncover the top three foods that she eats to maintain her health and two foods she avoids at all costs. Lastly, we'll take a peek into her love life, exploring her open marriage, divorce, and other relationships. Let's begin with her top three tips to feel young and fresh. When you live that much in the present and you trust that it's all right and that it's balanced, you somehow get a vision of the future that's pretty correct. Tip one, don't believe the numbers. Shirley MacLaine advises us not to fixate on our age. She believes it's more about how we feel rather than the number on our birthday cake. As she puts it, I don't care what birthday you're on. It's all about how you feel. According to her, there are days when she feels as youthful as 30, and she never lets herself feel older than 50 in her mind. She emphasizes that the number doesn't matter much, but gaining wisdom over the years is something to embrace. As she says, but I do have a sense that I have some wisdom now. It's good to be wise. It sure beats being young and clueless. So don't let the numbers dictate how you feel. Focus on embracing life with wisdom and vitality instead. Tip two, keep it moving. Shirley MacLaine encourages staying active as a key to feeling youthful, but she also stresses the importance of listening to your body and taking things at your own pace. She shares, I also know that the only thing in life I can't do is a full Jane Fonda workout. That's crazy anyways. In the past, she could spend hours dancing and working out, but now she's learned to adjust her routine. Instead of pushing herself to the limit, she opts for a more manageable workout. McLean reminds us that it's okay to adapt our activities as we age and to give ourselves permission to take breaks when needed. So, whether it's a brisk walk, gentle yoga, or even just stretching, the key is to keep moving while being mindful of our body's needs. How's life going, Shirley? I'm very, very, let's say, I'm not joyously happy because I've learned that's stupid. I am... What do you mean? I am content. Why is it stupid to be joyously happy? Because the fall comes. Tip three, stop worrying about the future. Shirley MacLaine's final piece of advice is to stop stressing about what's to come. She shares, one last thing that I know now. I haven't planned a damn thing ever in my life. Guess what? It worked out great. I wouldn't even know how to plan. I wouldn't have a clue. Instead of meticulously planning every detail, MacLaine advocates for living in the present moment. She believes that by focusing on the here and now, we can find greater fulfillment and joy. So rather than fretting about the future, embrace the spontaneity of life and relish each moment as it comes. Now that we've seen how Shirley MacLaine maintains her youthful energy and outlook on life, let's shift our focus to the nutritious and healthy foods she enjoys to stay fit and happy. Despite her gratitude for her health, Shirley MacLaine is mindful of what she eats. While she believes in indulging in what she craves, she also understands the importance of nourishing her body with wholesome foods 
Her love for food encompasses a variety of flavors, from the richness of salmon to the freshness of salads and the kick of espresso coffee. In the past, she had a bit of a sweet tooth, loving nothing more than a decadent chocolate or a scoop of ice cream. However, she's since made a conscious shift towards healthier options. Here are three foods that she eats to maintain her health. Salmon. Shirley MacLaine's favorite food, according to her personal chef, is a marinated smoked salmon filet topped with a zippy mustard sauce on a bed of mild green chill polenta. Not only does she enjoy smoked salmon, but she also has a fondness for other types of fish, both cooked and raw. As she puts it, I love Japanese food, especially sushi made with raw fish, flavored with wasabi, and served on mounds of vinegary rice in individual rice bowls. She adores salmon for its versatility and health benefits. Shirley believes that salmon is an excellent source of the proteins essential for building muscles, bones, and cartilage. This protein helps in maintaining muscle mass while losing weight, as well as supporting a healthy metabolic rate and bone density. Research supports Shirley's love for salmon, indicating that increasing consumption of fatty fish like salmon can decrease the risk of obesity, diabetes, and heart disease. Salmon is a fantastic protein alternative to options like chicken or beef. It offers ample protein with far less saturated fat content, making it an ideal choice for maintaining weight loss or a healthy body mass index BMI. Moreover, a study published in NDPI Journal has linked the intake of omega-3 fatty acids found abundantly in salmon to better cardiovascular health. The recommendation of consuming two servings of fatty fish per week, such as omega-3 rich salmon, is considered a healthful dietary pattern for heart health. Population studies have further associated baked or boiled fish intake with a reduced risk of heart disease and heart failure. Salad? Shirley, known for her appreciation of a wholesome lifestyle, also finds joy in a simple yet nourishing bowl of salad. As she explains, I typically eat six small meals in a day, which usually includes a salad like a fresh veg salad or potato salad and a cup of walnuts. This balanced approach to eating reflects her belief in the importance of fueling the body with foods rich in essential nutrients such as fiber, vitamins, including A, C, and K, minerals such as calcium, iron, and potassium. Healthy fats like omega-3 fatty acids quality proteins, and antioxidants, while still allowing for occasional indulgences in moderation. In her portrayal of Madame Susatska in the film of the same name, McLean underwent a significant physical transformation, gaining 25 pounds to authentically embody the character. During this time, she reminisces about the indulgent foods she consumed on set, saying wine, cookies. Every cookie in England has chocolate on one side. Despite enjoying these treats for her role, she later committed to a healthier lifestyle, including a nutritious diet. Salads hold a special place in McLean's diet, and she recognizes their nutritional benefits. Reflecting on her dietary choices, she says, I'd rather do stuff that makes me happy, but eating too much doesn't make me happy. Her approach to food is guided by a desire for both enjoyment and nourishment. According to a study published in the Journal of the American Dietetic Association, consumption of salad is significantly associated with better nutritional status. The study, which analyzed data from over 17,000 adults, found that salad consumers had higher levels of essential nutrients compared to non-consumers. Each serving of salad was linked to an improved level of vitamins in the blood, highlighting the positive impact of incorporating salads into one's diet. Shirley MacLaine's salad recipe, cash and vegetables, provides a flavorful and nutritious option for those looking to add more salads to their meals. Made with buckwheat groats, chicken stock, a variety of raw vegetables, and seasoned with garlic, onions, and herbs, this dish is both satisfying and wholesome. Tossed with a dressing spiked with jalapenos, it offers a delightful blend of flavors and textures, making it a favorite among salad enthusiasts. Coffee, espresso. Shirley MacLaine is known to have a deep affection for espresso, finding it to be a source of energy and enjoyment in her daily life. Beyond its ability to provide a boost of energy, coffee, including espresso, contains essential nutrients such as riboflavin, vitamin B2, pantothenic acid, vitamin B5, manganese, potassium, and magnesium. These nutrients play vital roles in various bodily functions, including energy metabolism, nerve function, and bone health. Additionally, coffee is a significant source of antioxidants, particularly chlorogenic acid and caffeic acid, which help neutralize harmful free radicals in the body, potentially reducing the risk of chronic diseases like heart disease and certain types of cancer. One of McLean's favorite spots to grab her espresso fix is a local Starbucks in Malibu, where she's often seen running in for her favorite brew. The energy-boosting effects of coffee can be attributed to its caffeine content, a central nervous system stimulant known for fighting fatigue and increasing energy levels. Studies have demonstrated the performance-enhancing effects of caffeine consumption, 
One study published in the Saudi Pharmaceutical Journal found that consuming caffeine increased time to exhaustion during exercise and significantly reduced subjective levels of fatigue in participants. Similarly, another study reported improvements in performance, subjective energy levels, and reduced feelings of fatigue among golfers who consumed caffeine before and during their game. For Shirley McLean, espresso represents not only a delicious beverage but also a source of vitality and enjoyment in her daily routine. Whether sipping on her favorite brew at Starbucks or reminiscing about past espresso mishaps, her love for coffee remains an integral part of her lifestyle. Now, let's talk about two foods she doesn't eat. Junk foods. Now, Shirley McLean is making changes to her diet to prioritize her health. She candidly admits, I'm on a diet for the first time in my life. I could eat sweets all day, but I've made a commitment to myself to lose weight. So that means cutting out chocolate and eating more fruit. Her dedication to healthier eating habits is evident as she incorporates exercise into her routine, stating, I hate exercise as much as anyone, but when I'm hiking with my dog Terry, it's not so bad. Junk foods are typically high in calories, sugars, unhealthy fats, and low in essential nutrients, and are a common temptation for many. Examples of junk foods include sugary snacks like candy bars and cookies, processed snacks like potato chips and cheese puffs, and sugary beverages including soda and sweetened fruit drinks. However, Shirley recognizes their potential impact on overall health. Research shows that most fast foods are high in carbohydrates and low in fiber, leading to spikes in blood sugar levels. Over time, frequent consumption of these foods can increase the risk of insulin resistance, type 2 diabetes, and weight gain. A study published in the Sadra Medical Journal in 2020 found a correlation between higher fast food intake and lower short-term memory scores among college students. Fried Foods Shirley McLean has embraced a healthier lifestyle by avoiding fried foods altogether. She emphasizes, You are never too old to diet. Demonstrating her commitment to making positive changes, fried foods such as fried fish, french fries, and chicken strips are often high in calories and trans fat, posing health risks when consumed regularly. Research supports the adverse effects of fried foods on health. A four-year study published in Journal of Public Health Nutrition found that consuming two servings of fried fish per week was associated with a higher risk of cardiovascular disease. In contrast, individuals who followed a diet rich in fruits and vegetables had a significantly lower risk. Now, let's talk about Shirley McLean's open marriage and controversies. McLean's marriage to businessman Steve Parker lasted from 1954 until their divorce in 1982, and they share a daughter, Saki. Surprisingly, in her late 20s, Sachi learned from her mother that an astronaut named Paul might be her biological father, not Steve Parker. Reflecting on her marriage, Shirley disclosed to People in 2016, I guess you would say practiced an open marriage in 1954, which was another lifetime. We were friends. And I guess you could say uh, practiced an open marriage in 1954. During a 2011 interview with Oprah Winfrey, Shirley revealed her unconventional approach to relationships, acknowledging her open marriage with her husband. She admitted that she often developed feelings for her leading men but noted exceptions such as Jack Lemmon and Jack Nicholson. Additionally, she had significant affairs with Lord Mountbatten and Australian politician Andrew Peacock. Despite her successful career, McLean has faced disputes with co-stars such as Anthony Hopkins and Deborah Winger. She's also known for her interest in spirituality and metaphysics, authoring books like Out on a Limb and Dancing in the Light, and exploring practices like transcendental meditation. Moreover, McLean's fascination with UFOs has drawn media attention, with her claiming encounters and even witnessing UFO incidents in the 1950s and at her New Mexico ranch. In fact, Shirley McLean has not only left her mark in Hollywood, but also in the political arena actively supporting George McGovern's presidential campaign in 1972 and contributing significantly to fundraising efforts. While her personal life and beliefs have sometimes stirred controversy, Shirley MacLaine's impact on both the entertainment industry and broader societal conversations remains undeniable. Shirley MacLaine's life is an exciting journey of staying healthy, eating well, and maintaining a vibrant spirit.